Right, hopefully, I'm back now. At least, I'm hoping I'm back. Okay, can everyone hear me? Can everyone see me? This is the important thing. Because I'm hoping that everyone... I'm back now. At least I'm hoping so. And it seems to be slightly better. Hey! There we go. Can everyone see me then now? I'm so sorry about the start. That is absolutely horrific. I've just knocked the bitrate down a little bit. And hopefully that will fix it. Oh, thank God. Right, okay. Right, now let's let's start the stream properly. I'm not going to redo the song. We've already been... We've already heard it. Let's just go through again. Okay. So, to set the scene then today, guys, it's a massive, massive, massive stream in the context of the series because, let's face it, I've not got off to the best start in this stream save. I've been sacked from one job, uh, nearly lost my other one. So, what I've decided to do is go to Forest Green for those that have just caught up, and we've been in a scintillating run of form. I mean, this here is excellent. We joined literally... I think it was the Wrexham game. So we joined around about here. So we've been absolutely on fire since I turned up. And with seven games to go, we are currently second in League Two. Only six points behind first place Wimbledon, who we will be playing today. But more importantly, we're three points ahead of Newport, who are currently in fourth. Three teams got from this division. So we've got a really good chance of securing automatic promotion, which is not ex well, mate, which is not expected of me. So we're doing very, very well indeed. Um Hopefully, then, we'll get up to a decent start. We're playing Port Vale, and they're seventh in the league at the moment, so they're actually quite good. All right? So this could, this is going to be a big one um, in terms of just everything today. This this could really revitalise the save, which would be amazing. So, in terms of the lineup, then, we're going to have McGee in goal, uh, Kigboo, Morte, the Kitching, and Wilson as the back four. Wilson playing on that advanced role really, really seems to work for him, although he's not been playing very well recently. I think he might need a bit of a rest. So, actually, we might... Um, if, if it wasn't Port Vale, I'd probably rest him, but we can't do that. So we're going to have Early, Lundstrom, and Hammer in the middle. Then we're going to have Cannon on the left, Koval on the right, and then Collins leading the line up front. Um, thank you, obviously, everyone, for joining in. If you are new, uh, then do obviously subscribe. If you're not, then please drop a like on the video. Even if you're new, drop a like on the on the stream, because I like to try and get to double figures to start with if, it, if I can. Right, let's pick it from where we left last time off, which was with another win. Hopefully, the more wins we get the better this will be. Uh, we might even still win the title. We've got seven games to get through. It's going to be a bit of a longer stream. Seven games to win the title. That's the most important thing. Thank you very much for everyone that's just left a like. They've probably jumped up to seven, like I said. Three more. I'll be absolutely delighted. Why is there a fraud on my screen? There's never a fraud addresser. Never. Um, how are you, mate? Thank you very much for joining in. Oh, right, okay. If we can beat Port Vale, I'll be beautiful. Fantastic fans are exactly. Um, yeah, I, I won't lie. I'm hoping today goes quite well because, like I said, I've not got off to the best start to my day. I've been a little bit wired, um, it's safe to say. I've been a little bit annoyed. I've had some sort of semi-recording issues. It's been a little bit annoying. But, yeah, we'll, we'll go with it. Um, King Boo was sitting in Collins. Coville! Oh, Vaughn Coville, by the way, has been absolutely fire recently. Um Shame you can't clip more dumb stuff on YouTube. It is, it is terribly a shame. Although you, you yesterday addressed that sneaky mate trying to drive a wedge between me and the followers. It's not, not on, not on. But it was quite funny. Um, is everyone watching the Spurs game later? Nah, mate. I've got some paint that needs to dry. Um, I think I'll probably watch that. Although I'd pray Marine win more than anything. Uh, hello, uh, Ahsoka Tano, aka It's Football Plus. How are you, mate? Thank you very much for joining in. Yes, Aaron Collins. Yes. That is the start I needed. Get in. Well done, boys. It's a good start. Aaron Collins has been very good since he came back in. This is making me feel much better. I think most of the world is desperate for Marine to win, to be fair. Their goalie there has had an absolute mare. Why in the world did he come out for that? There was literally <laughs> no reason to come out for that. But it's a good start. We've already got our goal. Now we need to do is just see the game out comfortably and we will be fine. Do that and we'll be beautiful. Yes, I know about Troy Parrott Football Plus. Coville! Oh, Vaughan Coville, you legend. Leeds are getting beaten. Leeds are getting beaten 3-0 by Crawley Town. Oh, bloody hell. Oh, yeah, no, someone mentioned that to me. I've not been watching it, annoyingly. I wish I had. Although, it's Leeds, isn't it? To be fair, they are a bit like that. Uh, the Micromunch 14 8 is... Viewers clip is now your most viewed clip. Is that by you, by any chance, address? <laughs> I mean, it's it's not great that that's my most viewed clip, but I'm glad that it's there. 
lead to playing the main team is something bloody hell. Well, you didn't like West Ham do that with like Wimbledon last year. Was it AFC Wimbledon? I think they did that with that last year. It might well have been. Okay, Corey. Corey is easier to remember. All right, come on, more say that. Go on, good boy with the top, please. Lovely. Oh, that's a foul ref. Coville. Oh my god, this kid's insane. This kid's absolutely insane. <laughs> Well, I mean, that was that. That's just common decency, Adrista. That's what that is. That's just common decency. He would have been better off just telling me that he wasn't on the phone, and then I wouldn't have said anything. But hey ho, we we live and we learn. Come on, Morte. This is all we need is a five nil Marine win now, and then we'll be matching. I'll take a I'll take a nil nil and a win on penalties. I'll I'll take any kind of Marine win today. Sign Jamal Lowe and Troy. I will do what I must, um, Corey. If I can sign them, then I will, because obviously they're quite good players. But if I can't, then I'm going to try and get Troy Parrott, because I think he'll be amazing at League One level, if we get promoted. you got to remember, whenever people tell me to sign people, you need to see it. I'll do what I can, mate. I can't. Pro I mean, Jamal Lowe is going to be very difficult for me to sign him for Forest Green, but Troy Parrott I might be able to get in on a loan, maybe. Maybe. I'll do what I can, mate, but you can't cheat on FM. Like It's not like FIFA where I can literally just give anyone what they want. But I might be able to do it on this, maybe, if I'm lucky. That wasn't a pen, by the way, by any stretch of the imagination. Oh, yes, Aaron Collins. That's beautiful. David Raven's playing from Marine. I do remember him, but it's very, very... What team did David Raven play for? I recognise the surname... Well, I'm not going to be able to afford him then, Corey, because I've I've got minus 400 grand in there, mate. This isn't FIFA. I can't just magic £4 million up out of my arse. <laughs> um, so I'll never be able to get him. I won't be able to get him on FM. There's no... Not with Forrest Green. I might be able to get him or Troy on the loan, but I won't be able to sign him. Not, not in a month of Sundays, mate. I wish I could. Trust me. They'd be really, really good for the team, but that ain't going to happen. Trust me. Oh... He came for Liverpool camp. That's where I remember the name from. I think I probably played with him in one of like my old FM saves and when I was Liverpool. That would make sense. Aaron Collins has got three. He's got a hat trick in the first half. Port Vale meant to be seventh, and we're literally smashing them here. This is beautiful. Uh, the more important thing as well is that means I can give Kane a rest so Tyrone Williams can come on, and then I can take him off the wing back attack, and he can just put on full back. Uh, you go and defend, mate. We're going to sit this out. Uh, Cannon can come off, and then Otterball can come on for a bit. Victor can come on for a little second. Thank you very much. We're only one like away from the 10. I'm so excited. I did a Wimbledon career, but I won the league and grabbed 8 million. Out of my what? Is that on FM or was that on FIFA? Because there's no way they'll give you 8 million pounds for doing it on, out on FM. <laughs> it's okay, but I know what you meant. It's fine. Don't worry. <laughs> oh, if hopefully the rest of the stream goes like this, we'll be absolutely fine. Yeah, well, FIFA's not realistic in the slightest, mate, so I'm not surprised that you managed to do that. Yeah. There's no way they'd give you that. How has Solomon missed that? How has he missed that? Oh, how has he missed that? That should be five. Hopefully the stream will just continue like this, because this is nice. I'm enjoying this. This is nice for me. Um, is there anyone else I need to rest up? Might rest up Lundstrom, actually. Bring on... Let's bring on Undai for a bit, because he's quite good. Let's bring him on. See how he gets on. Hopefully we'll be all right. I support... His badge is triggering me. <laughs> Oh, I think most United fans would probably accept the fact that they probably didn't deserve to win that game, in all fairness. <laughs> um, so I wouldn't particularly worry about Adam's one of those Adam's one of those nice United fans. As is Ronan. Whenever he comes on Boom Pool, he's a he's a nice United fan. Not one of the ones that I used to want to punch while I was in school. <laughs> Because, like, yeah, everyone in that was a United fan. 
back when I was well, back when I was a kid. It's just annoying. I love that from you, Adam. Fair enough. I'm not bothered. Where are you in the league? They're, they'll be ahead of you soon, mate. Trust me. They'll be ahead of both of us very, very soon. Very soon. They'll be ahead of Liverpool and United very, very soon. Sadly. I wish it wasn't the case, but it's going to be City. You've pretty much nearly got the league all wrapped up already, which is annoying. Uh, uh, yeah. I was. Good. I think the United. You, you. I think United are about to hit one of those streaks. I mean, granted, like you change the team around a lot, but you, you're getting into that state where when Fernandez isn't playing well, because he'll get knackered. And once that Fernandez gets knackered, there is no United. Sad to say, but it's you know it's it's true though, isn't it? Without him, like the stats back it all up. Without Fernandez, they are literally like lower mid table probably. But with him genius that's just how much of a difference the guy makes but he's got to be fit and firing do you know what i mean if he's not fit then you're not have got a serious serious problem serious problem because i don't think you can rely on the rest of those players to perform consistently week in week out especially not in the middle of the park i wouldn't rely on pogba if you my life depended on it <laughs> do you know what i mean because <laughs> he's pretty atrocious <laughs> when he wants to be I'm trying to think about now how old David Raven is after Cleo said about David Raven. I'm kind of interested to see how bloody old he is now. I'm trying to remember like, how old ago that was. 28? 29? Maybe? Maybe a bit younger? Maybe. Uh, that's this guy. The Zuma guy is the guy that's in Barrow. The one that I thought was absolutely atrocious in my Barrow FIFA save. So I might actually have to sign him. Because uh, he's meant to be quite good. Von Coville is amazing. If I signed him, he is actually contracted to the club. Good. Because he's flipping amazing at the moment. I didn't realise he was American either. Might have a little bit of a, a young American starlet on our hands here. Because he's very good. I'm going to praise him as well, actually. Say, so, well done, mate. You're doing good. Uh, I'm going to criticise Nicky Can though. You, sir, not so good. Not so good. Hopefully we'll be able to get up for that. So we've got Wrexham coming up. Wrexham coming up. Okay. Oh, I'm hoping that we can get through. If I can get promoted, I'd say that it's been one of my better... Hopefully we're going to get a promote this year. I'd like to think so. If I have done that, I think it would be... <laughs> Yeah, well, I don't think they've really got a lot of place to wind you up about at the moment, mate, to be fair. I'd much rather be a City fan than a United fan right now, if I'm honest. Apart from the things that naturally get associated with people being a City fan, which are pretty much the same as you used to get accused of if you were a United fan back in the 90s, or the thousands, to be fair. Because that's all that used to happen. But... In all fact, like I said, the, I, actually my best mate is a United fan, which sounds really strange considering obviously I'm a I'm a Liverpool fan. I'm not going to put that out there, mate. Easy with your language, none of that, especially not this early during the day. Because at the moment, I'm for, well, Adam is my mod, so. It's easy, mate. Don't be using that kind of language around here. All right. Thank you. If that's all right. Only I can use that language. I wouldn't use it this early. Yeah, you know this, mate. You've asked me this before, and I've told you I'm a Liverpool fan. We've had this chat before. <laughs> correct, Cleo. Correct. It is a family show. So just chill, chill your pants now. Yeah, yeah, you have, mate. You asked me the other day and I told you I was a, a Liverpool fan. But don't worry, I'm an understanding one. So I'm a I'm a pessimistic Liverpool or a realistic Liverpool fan at the moment. I'm not one of the ones that usually rubs it in, if that makes any sense. I still can't quite believe we won the top, to be fair. <laughs> All 
Alright, okay. Wrexham's up next. Come on, we can do this. We can beat them. Easy, I think. Maybe. We should be able to. If we've literally just beat Port Vale 7-0, we should be able to beat them. Very well trained. Nah, mate, just, just old and mature, I think, would be the best way to put it. I can dish out banter when it's required, but... I've had years of people lording it over me, like United and City fans and Chelsea fans. I've had years of them lording it over me when they were successful and I hated it. So I don't want to do the same. Put the ciders down. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Um, there's your squad. There's your squad, Corey. It's right here, mate. I doubt you'll recognise many of them, to be fair, mate. Um... I don't really need to change it, actually. We're pretty well rested. We've had two weeks break, which actually probably came at a bad time, to be honest. I don't think that came at the right time. I could have done with us having a little bit more. Um, but hey-ho, we'll go with it. Right, so... Just kind of carry on straight away from you did last match out, lads. Same as last time. I'll be delighted if I can get away with it. Uh, also, as a heads up, we will be doing the... Um, Manchester Rovers stream over on Twitch later tonight and hopefully we're going to get to the end of the season on that as well so that's going to be like a two, three hour long stream probably around about 8pm so make sure you're on that <laughs> I think United fans have given themselves that reason for us all not to like them do you know what I mean but you can't be like that for all of them yeah Vaughan Covels he's arguably my um, well he is probably my best player at the moment he's been absolutely amazing Although, I have to say, signing Hammer, I think, was a little stroke of genius. Coryville. Oh, my God, he's missed. You dopey sod. Do I know Ian Kilford? I've actually recognised the name, but I don't obviously know. I couldn't tell you off the top of the head, like, where he played for or who it was. No. Go on, Cadden. That's such a poor finish. Such a poor finish. Why are you hitting it in at the near post there, mate? Get it wider. Oi, oi. Then no, I don't know him. I thought you were talking about a footballer. I do reckon I, um, I do know a footballer called Kilford. I'm certain of it. Ah, right, okay. That's probably why I know of the name, but I don't recognise where he's playing for. Hmm. This is not going very well, is it? I thought we'd be ahead by now. I like it when we get an early goal, because then we literally just go and absolutely punish teams to death. But when it takes a little while to get going, that's when I feel like the FM gods are beginning to take the mick a little bit. Uh, come on, boys, for God's sake, what's going on here? Ah, oh, this is not good. Come on. What an awful half of football. I've literally had two highlights, and literally both of them were just near post passes to nothing. This is not helping my... This isn't going to help my mood. Come on. I told the boys I'm not happy, and they just don't... They just don't care. Come on. We can do better than this, surely. I will change the formation if I need to. I'll have to probably go two up top, maybe match them. It's maybe the way to go. We've not created enough at all. Uh, Lundstrom's not having a good game. So, if Lundstrom's not having a good game, take him off. I'm going to bring on... Da, 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 da. I might bring on... I'll bring on Endai, and he's going to have to go up front as well. Uh, what can you play? Actually, maybe not here. Maybe Otterfor. Yeah, get Otterfor on, or Otterbor. You can go false nine, mate. Sit in there, make it happen. Early, you can go in there. Uh, deep line playmaker, get him on support as well because I don't think they're offering too much going forward thank you very much for the 10th like over just left it much appreciated so I've gone 4-4-2 and I'm probably just about to get punished for it I'd hazard a guess that's better, go on go on, go on, go on, release Aaron you can see it, Aaron get in, it's worked oh my god, something I did worked unreal, managerial genius something I did actually paid off I don't believe it. it might be from Wigan that I recognise the name then. That's a lovely touch by Collins. What a finish. He's on fire right now. Get on oh, no. though. It's a highlight straight away. That's not what I want to hear. Here, see. Sorry. Oh, lovely. Well done, Hammer. Come on, let's just get a second. Put it to bed. 
Ely, boy, we're talking mm, Koval, that's not good. Go and get their first hammer. I love him, hammer in the middle of the park. He's amazing. MC, hammer. Do, 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 do. Koval, Collins. Yep, yep, yeah, 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 that's good. Go on, Kane. Good ball in. Roast him. No. Hammer, go on. You, you can put a good ball in. Yeah. What a block that is. I don't believe that. On your way to being a Forest Green legend. Yes, I hope so. I would love to be a Forest Green legend considering I've actually been there and, and seen the team for real. And I used to go and watch them a lot. Solomon! Oh, you've got to bury that, lad. Kilford scored one or two when they got beaten by Brent when Brentford beat them. Sorry, when they beat Brentford 4 0. Don't remember the game, funnily enough, but I'll have to take your word for it, mate. Oh, go on, Solomon. Off you go. On your own, son. Must be. Oh, that is awful. That's an awful finish. He's literally hit it so wide. So wide. Uh, Hammer's getting quite tired. Take him off then. Actually, it might be tight. Um, do I do it? No, I can't go defensive just yet. Not when it's 1 0. It's still in the balance. Oh, you stick with them and don't give up. No, nah, as long as I'm happy at a club, I'll always stay there, Clear, Don't worry. I quite like the idea of taking a team like this. If a big offer comes along, then we'll talk about it when we get there. But um, for the time being, no. I'm, I'm very, very happy here at Forest Green. Things are going quite well. Um, I gave up on the Cagliari one because I don't think there was any real, like, there was no affection for the team. And I don't think anyone was particularly enjoying it that much. So that's why I kind of was just like, yeah. I'm not getting the feel for it. But this, this is my level. Lower league football is my level, annoyingly. Because it shows when I get to the Premier League, I suck. Come on, boys. Just hold on. Just hold on. All we need to do is see out the next three minutes. Do I make a change? Do I make a change? I've got four minutes to go. We've really dominated the game, but... Check. Oh, no. Oh no, two minutes of added on time. Don't give the ball away like that. Okay, that's one. Well, in kitchen. Go on, Kane. Good ball in, mate. Get the second. Let's just tie this up. Kane Wilson, that's genius. Solomon, Cadden, that's a stupendous save. Oh no, no. Get yeah, good at it. No, 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 no. Please don't. Not like this. Well done, early, you legend. Solomon, go on. This time. This time. Oh, you absolute... Yeah, it might be time, actually. <clears throat> time to waste some time with a sub. We're going cautious, 4 3, three as well. Solomon, I'm going to take off Collins. Off you come, mate. You've been very good, but it's time to come off. Uh, Tyrone Williams, on you come. Sit back. No. Th let me put my bloody defender... Thank you. There we go. <clears throat> there you go. Four minutes out. And bang, there you go, a one nil win. <sighs> ground it out, I think would be the, the we didn't play particularly well, but we ground it out, and that's what matters. Secure the playoff spot. See, I've done exactly what I was told to do when I first got here. Genius. How can they be a little jaded and do with the rest? They had two weeks off. Two weeks off they had. Beautiful. Right, okay. When's our next game? Fourteen days. I got another four. I got another two weeks. So if they're knackered after that, there is no excuse. There's actually no excuse for them to be knackered after that. Jammy, easy promotion, lad. Maybe, mate. I hope so. You've been scouted for Bristol as well. Oh well, well done to you, Corey. Congratulations, mate. Um, I'm gonna get these. I'll just give them a little bit of a rest because they play quite well there, so they deserve a couple of days off. Let's just keep us well rested and ready to go. Oh, Tranmere in ninth. So, where? what's the state of play then? Oh, actually, I'll tell you what. I have got a game in hand, though, Newport. But I could well be five points clear of the playoffs. We should be, mate. Position I used to play as well when I played. Nice. Oh, God. I'm feeling really nervous now. I was nervous. I am feeling a bit nervous now. <clears throat> Clubs in England set to release players. See, these are where you can little get the, the, the decent little signings, can't you? 
because that these guys are all going to get released. So this is where you can find some decent little some decent little signings. So I'm just going to have a little little scout out of these guys to see if there's anyone worth signing out of the uh, those under 18s. Probably not. Next for another one. Well, I'll keep my eyes peeled for you, Corey, mate, and see if that's true, mate. Uh, I don't want a foot. Hmm. He could be quite good. Yeah, he could be very good because Joe Riley, that'd be good. Like Rachel Riley, but a man. <laughs> oh, Rachel Riley. Sorry, I was getting distracted. Uh, it's also good because I'm going to get to change around the bloody um, staff finally as well by the end of this because I haven't had a chance to get in my own staff or anything yet. So we've been really kind of up against it in all fairness. Collins gets player of the month. Six goals in four games. I can see why. Well done, lad. Uh, Von Coville comes third in the... And then... Oh, okay, cool. Oh, I've won manager of the month. Yes. And Dale Vince is happy. Uh... Beautiful. I'll be in my 40s or 50s when I start playing Fresh League because you're 12. Uh, I'll try to think about that. So probably six years time. I'll probably be, because I'm 31 now, so I'll probably be yeah, 37, like nearing 40. Not 50, but nearing 40, probably. Oh, God, that's depressing. God, that's depressing. Now, if you're that age, you should not be using the kind of language that you were using earlier. I will point that out right now. Not to sound like a dad, but tut tut is all I will say. <laughs> Mind you, was I that bad when I was a kid? I don't think I used that word, but yeah. I thought I was 28. 31, mate. 31. But thank you. I'll take the fact that I look younger. Thank you. I won't say anything, but like I said, no, I'm 31, mate. Sadly, getting getting older. The greys are going to start appearing in the beard. That'll be the that'll be the downside. Well, apparently that's actually quite a good look. So maybe I'll actually try and like coin that for myself. It's when the grey hairs start that I'm going to be in trouble. That's going to be my main issue. If that's true, then yes, I'll let it slide. <laughs> oh no, why? I don't want to lose Liam Kitching for three days. That's not good. I don't... I look about 40. <laughs> you you sad. <laughs> oh, okay, fair enough, mate. enough dude i'm happy to hear, well i'm happy to hear it for you obviously Corey, but well done mate in that case i'll i'll let it slide so i can understand it but i can't have it being shown on the stream so i won't say it out loud <laughs> for obvious reasons thank you for tuning in though mate that's really kind of you to tune in though and it's nice that you've been really involved in the comment section effort as well recently thank you it's always good to see people that comment quite a lot and everything and i don't think i'm gonna forget that sebi about you calling me 40 I, I I will remember that. Don't you worry about that. Can't all be, you know, mid-twenties and looking fine, Seb, like some people. So, hey-ho. I'll get better looking with age. That's what I keep saying to myself. I got a new mouse mat as well, which my sister bought me for Christmas, and it's amazing. I'm your favourite YouTuber at the moment. Thank you very much, mate. That's always nice to hear. Thank you. Long may it continue. Uh, uh, yeah, exactly. James is like the kind of quiet guy in there. He literally just like deal you a smack down. Like, but just like waiting silently in the wings. Oh, I can't really afford to rest Kane or Kitchen, can I? I need both of them. I need them to be fit and firing. Oh, there's nothing wrong with being obsessed with Star Wars. 
That's a very healthy thing. Don't worry about that. We all love a bit of Star Wars. I hate them! Oh, don't start. I'll start quoting, and that's not a good thing for anybody. Especially when double A is not here. I've got something under my mouse, man. It's upsetting me. What is that? Oh, oh hello. I also had, earlier, the most sourest tangerine possibly on the face of the earth, and it was horrible. I still can't quite get the taste out of my mouth. That's... Annoying. Actually, it's not. I thought that was Arvorn. To be fair, I thought that was Ar Arvorn, but it wasn't. So that's quite good news, actually. I'm glad that that got disallowed. Sorry, I'm literally trying to figure out whatever this is underneath my mouse mat and get rid of it. He activates his trap card. Yeah, too right. I'm worried here, though. Because uh, Tram is going to be a difficult game. It's the Wimbledon one coming up. If we can keep winning and then we beat Wimbledon, suddenly we're in with a chance of actually winning the league, which would be un like literally next level stuff. I think I don't think Forest Green have ever been in League One or the Third Division, have they? <laughs> so here for when Mike is enjoying life, I appear out of nowhere and slap him with some comment. <laughs> I wouldn't have it any other way, mate. Bloody hell, Wimbledon are winning again. Hmm. Hmm. God, they're winning two now. Okay. Slap him down and keep him grounded. Yeah, can't be letting me get too ahead of myself, can we? Oh, this is annoying. Come on, lads. I need a goal, really, then. I want to, I want to win the league. Man, I need some Star Wars. Oh, yeah. Ta I want to... Where's that from? So Tano. Which one's that from, mate? Uh, oh, God. I'm feeling really nervous now. I really want to win this game. If we win this game, actually, with the way things stand, would that mean I would be very, very close to being unassailable and I've get, got him promoted? Just need to grab that goal. Do I go 4 4 2 again? That's the question. It did work last time. This is away from home. Exactly. I'm not happy with the performance though there. Vaughan's been quiet. By his standards. Come on. I mean we've dominated it in terms of like XG etc. But that doesn't mean anything. Because we haven't got the goal yet. Do I go 4-4-2? Isaac Buckley Ricketts has nearly got a goal. Well he's got a goal back for Salford against Wimbledon. <laughs> that's amazing though Corey I love that I love Star I used to love Star Wars as a kid I still love it now but like I like quoting it now but I was obsessed with Star Wars when I was a kid and Lord of the Rings oh god hello just banged my desk around all over the place sorry if it looked like there was an earthquake going on there I think it's summer made a change do I really go for it that's the question I'm going to take the Lundstrom off again. I'm going to go and do what I did last time. Because we did start opening them up quite a lot when I had Ottafor and Collins playing. So Early's going to go in there. Deep line playmaker. Get him on support as well. Get him pushed a little bit further forward. We're going to go for it. Oh, Star Wars Lego sets were literally just like, yes. So good. <clears throat> Collins playing at 6.4. That's not good enough, is it? Have all figures in the 98s because of your uncle. That's cool. Oh my god. Coville, Collins. No. No, don't. No, not like this. Go away, Willery, whoever you are. No, no, no. Go away, Louis Tomlinson. You are my least favourite of One Direction. Go, Coville. Go. Go. Solomon, please. Must be. You are so useless. Ah, he just loves hitting it over the near post. What's wrong with you? He's obsessed with hitting the crowd. <laughs> How's that? Perfect, thank you, mate. Apart from the fact we're not winning this game. But hello, double A. Thank you very much for the like as well, mate. I'm assuming that was you. Oh, Count Dooku. Dooku's great. 
It would be wise, my friend. Oh, come on! Ooh. We're gonna drop points away at Tranmere. Aren't we? I even went for it. And look at the XG. That chance for Ottafor was our chance. And he's absolutely ballsed it up. <sighs> Gutting, that is. He's not Gandalf, mate. He's Saruman. Christopher Lee is, is Saruman. Ian McKellen is Gandalf. But I see where you're coming from. I think I did. I'm trying to remember. All right, Harry has a hand. Wasn't it? Um, isn't that Harry Potter? Is it Harry Potter double A? Am I being mad? Uh, so on the Twitch stream of channel points, can you make a reward where you can use channel points to rename another player? Provided, yes. Rachel letting you play this. You could do with Albus Dumbledore as a creative winger. Could you imagine the zines? Now oh, that's it. Hello, Nicholas. How's the hand? Oh, yeah, no, of course, obviously, because he gets stabbed through the hand, doesn't he? I remember that now, yeah. It's Jim Broadbent. Rachel letting me play this. You, I, I can play what I want. But I feel like a teapot. Don't you worry about that, mate. But I've been enjoying it recently. I am Saruman. Or oh, Saruman as he should be. You fell through fire and water. On the lowest dungeon of the highest peak, I fought him, the bound rock of Morgoth. Before I smote my enemy, <laughs> that's it. Before I struck down my enemy and smote his ruin upon the mountain side. So good. Oh, I need to watch it now. I need to go and watch it. I love it so much. If it was Harry Potter universe versus Star Wars universe versus Marvel universe, who's going to win? Oh. oh, that's that's actually a tough question. No, we're not, James. No, but she's my best mate. Which, yeah, it was. We always were best mates. So no, 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 we're not. We're not. We're just best mates. <laughs> I love that double A. I say Star Wars. I had a feeling you might do Corey. I don't. I don't know. All right, Cleo. No worries. I'll probably still be on when you get back. Anyway, you're about to miss the big game against Wimbledon. No. This is the one. This is the moment. Ooh, Star Wars over Harry Potter over MCU. Mm. Ciao, see you later. Thanks for watching. Uh, I've got to go with the same team again. This is a massive game of football now. I'm on nobody's side. Because nobody's on my side, little orc. What a, what a film. They come with fire. They come with axes. Gnawing, biting, breaking, hack and burning. Ooh, Sebi's going MCU. I do like the MCU. I do like the MCU. I'm not really 100% sure on that. I like all of them. That! Yes! That is exactly what we needed. Marvel's not bad. Marvel's great. But I do love a bit of Star Wars. There's too many great characters in Star Wars. I mean, Aaron Collins has literally like karate kicked before that's even gone in. Before the ball has even arrived at him. I love that. Oh, it's so annoying. Can you imagine if we'd won the game a minute ago? We'd literally only be three points behind them. And there would be a real chance of winning the title. Can I actually secure it today? Not quite, because Morecambe have got 73 points, so not quite. In Legends, Star Wars would easily win. Oh, yeah, probably. 
Like when you've got like Han Solo and Luke, Leia, Chewie, Jabba. I mean, they've got so many great characters. Vader, Palpatine, who's literally like my favourite character ever. Adam's going Star Wars, Marvel, then Potter. Harry, Harry's not getting a lot of love here. The question is, which ones of the films are the best, though? I do love Star Wars. Um, mind you, I love the Star Wars films. It's it's hard for me to say that Star Wars doesn't win in pretty much every aspect. But I do love... The way I put it, I think... If I was to watch a series... I would always watch. I'd watch. I'd rather watch the Harry Potter film series, but my favorite film. Oh, pardon me. But my favorite films are from Star Wars and Marvel. What Adam? What? I've only ever watched the first film and read the first book of Harry Potter. Adam, no, no. What? You're missing out on some absolute quality memeage, as well as actually some pretty good. The books, especially, are amazing. I can't speak too much for the film. I mean, the films are good, but I can't speak too much for them. But like, oh mate, you need to you you got to get that rectified. It's so good. At least you get my some my my poor Daniel Radcliffe acting references. Although to be fair to him, he was literally only like. 10 when he started, bless him. Oh, the Stephen Fry audiobooks of the Philosopher's Stone, mate. I'm pretty sure Robbie Coltrane based, like, his Hagrid on that. I'm certain that he did. Alright there, Harry! Sorry about that. I love it. I absolutely adore Harry Potter. I adore Hagrid. But Hagrid, there is no such thing as platform nine and three quarters, is there? Do not. <laughs> I know you love your Star Wars, mate. I love all of them, so I can't really be offended by any of them. I love every single... I love all Star Wars, and I love Harry Potter, and I also love um, Marvel, so... No, oh, mate. The Harry Potter ones are the best. Do it, do it. The Harry Potter books are so good. I promise you. <coughs> you will not regret it. The, the Potter books are amazing. Hey, Booker. Hey, Booker. You know your fact. Yeah, that is true. I just realised this game has really passed me by quite a lot because I've been too busy getting into the <laughs> getting into the Star Wars Marvel Potter debate. I think everyone agrees with you, to be fair, Corey, about like Star Wars being the best universe. I haven't seen anyone apart from Sebi say Marvel. I can't, um, which I could also understand because I quite like Marvel. But like, apart from that, I think pretty much most people agree with you. No, don't you dare. Don't you, don't you dare. Oh, God, that was close. Let's go route one, lads. That was close. Catch in! That's a big win. We've beaten them. Yes! Yes! Right, that's good news. We've beaten top. I've got to say, actually, we've got, a, we've got as close as it comes to an actual rivalry for Forest Green coming up. Um, and that is going to be the game against Cheltenham. Because that's almost like a local rivalry. Trust me, I was when I lived in Gloucester, and obviously Forest Green is quite near Gloucester, there was some absolute carnage when those two played like each other. Like a genuine detest. There was carnage. It was not pretty. How come I had like literally two weeks between games and now suddenly out of nowhere I've just got loads of games all in one go? Oh yeah, Marvel smashes on DC. DC's probably got some like better characters. It's definitely got better villains. But like like the films are terrible in comparison to Marvel ones. But DC's villains are amazing. Let's get through the car. Right, what have we got coming up? 
I'm getting I'm getting nervous now. Squeaky bum time. I think we can secure promotion if we win this game against Harrogate. So I'm nine yeah, nine points clear. We've pretty much done it. Because my goal difference is massive in comparison to Thorfs. I think we've done it, guys. I think we've I think we've secured promotion. Yes! But we haven't mathematically, and that's what matters. We need to win this game, then we've got promotion. And then we can focus on maybe nicking a title off of Wimbledon, but it's unlikely. I just want to try and finish as high as we can now. This is beautiful. Come on, boys. We can do this. Munch feeling the nerves. Always. Against bloody Harrogate as well. Come on. We can do this. Now, I'm not holding a team meeting. It never goes well. It never goes well if I hold a team meeting. <sighs> Deep breaths I'm nervous are we going to do it that is the question the form has been so damn good like literally our form has been look at that come on Forrest come on Forrest exactly look at this look at it we've been unbeaten since December <clears throat> everybody celebrate the promotion I bloody well hope so mate well we don't know yet it, we, we we need a point. A point from the next three games secures promotion. I'm going full strength. No messing about. No messing about. And then we're going to smash them, hopefully. Come on. We can do this. Kaziah Sterling is going to be hard to handle. Um, I was going to say, I feel like you win this game and keep our run going. Don't even mention the promotion. Let's not even mention it. Let's just go out there. Do our job, win the game, go home. That's all we need to do. That's literally all we need to do. Exa easy. Exactly, Corey. Exactly. Maybe. <laughs> Nothing's ever easy on FM, but they are 18th. So we've been given a golden opportunity. Put it that way. Come on, boys. Come on. Wimbledon already winning. That's not what I need. And they're winning away at Tranmere just to rub it into me. Oh, what a save, McGee. Bloody hell, that was close. <laughs> P-R-O-M-O-T-I-O-N. Promotion. Oh, God. I hope so, Corey, but I'm nervous, man. I was nervous, and I am nervous right now. We've not started well. That's for sure. Someone to stay on Keziah Sterling. Do not let him get on the ball too much, please. Just give him some encouragement. Come on, boys. We can do this. I need someone to step up. Didn't mention it. No. Come on, Coville. Uh, I've just got to assume Vaughan Coville is going to do something magic. I'm so nervous. I'm literally just like tapping my fingers together really, really quickly. <laughs> but off camera so you can't see it. I've got a nervous twitch going on right now. I don't like it when we don't score early. And I don't like the fact that they're having a lot of set pieces is annoying me. Come on, let's just nick the ball off them and then just get a counter-attack goal. Just get ahead, please. Go on, Belshaw. Bugger this up. That'll do. That'll do. Coville. Wilson, decent ball in, Kane. It's good. It's not good. It's early. That's a pen. Ref! How's that not a penalty? Not having that. Lindstrom, Cadden. Go on, Nick. Go on, Nicky. Nicky, don't... That's a pen. That's a pen. Come on. Come on, Aaron. Bury this, lad. Bury it. Go on, please. Collins. Yes! Come on. 1-0. Come on. Come on. Beautiful. <sighs> Tense. Collins, 20th of the season. And to think, I played a fair amount of my time without him even here. Come on, lads. Great stuff. I am excited. All we have to do is keep this lead. Kirby over the top. Kirby! Uh, to Coville. Oh, come on. Come on, Coville. That's good. Collins. Ball. Cannon! That is an awful finish. That's such a bad finish. 
How has he missed that? Hit it in the far corner. Why is he loving it on the near post? <laughs> that you do. That you do at the moment, Corey. Normally we've got a few people that fly in, mate, but you're 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 on it today. Oh, they have one chance, which is a brilliant save from McGee. Other than that, we've been excellent. Just got to keep doing what we're doing. I'm nervous. Can you tell? I've I've always been prone to a bottle job, so <laughs> I'm always I'm always really nervous before it even starts. Why am I going a bit northern? Why am I talking about being nervous? Uh, Corey's got to run the show today. He's been on fire. Uh, oh shit! That's annoying. Bloody Kirby. Was it Kirby with the pass here? It's a bloody good one there. Good finish there by Sterling. Oh, Jesus Christ. He's given me issues all day. Well, I say that. That's the second shot they've had. Damn it! Come on. Come on. What? Don't you even think about it. Don't think about it, Kirby. Jesus, who is this kid? And why is he suddenly so good? What's happening? Um, uh, yes, I do. I apologise. Oh, bugger me. Wilson, go on. It's it. That is just awful. That is just awful. What are you doing? Um, Lundstrom coming off. I've got to go Solomon again. I've got to go for it again. I want to win. I just want to win the game outright and get it done. I mean, um, why am I not allowed nice things? Why does everything have to be so bloody difficult? I mean, come on. Look at this. Eight shots on target to their two. And somehow we're drawing. I mean, come on now. Don't do not do this. Don't be that. <laughs> no, 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 mate. I, I pick my mods quite carefully. I've got a long... I've got a long queue of people that want to be a mod. Oh, come on, boys. What is this? Well, we're not winning the title. Yeah, no, a draw is enough. But, uh, well, it doesn't matter anyway, because I think um, Wimbledon have won the title anyway. But we, I think we've got the job... I was going to say, I think we've got the job done. You're bottling your save as well at the moment. I mean, that's... The well, Trace has just been sent off. So, that's disgusting behaviour. Get him off my pitch. <laughs> Come on, boys. They've got ten men now. We should really... Or not? Well, and well, we've well, we've got the point. We've got our point. We've done it. That's all that matters. We've we've got to the League One. Success. I have no idea how we've done it, but we've got to League One. Oh, thank God! I genuinely didn't think we were going to be able to do it when I first did it there. Uh, there you go. Get in. Afternoon, Rachella. How are you? you we, we've literally just got promoted. Yes. Which is great news. Oh, apparently we're still in an ongoing title battle. How is that possible? We're not in an ongoing title battle. Look, we're... There's two games to get... Right, okay. Oh, Good. Uh, are you playing Final Fantasy later, Rachel? Tell the fans. Tell them what they want to hear. The answer is yes. The stream's going well, Rachel. Like I said, we're, we're still unbeaten. I've been unbeaten in ages, to be fair, for Forest Green. We've literally just got promoted. Life is good. 
We've done it. It's the most important thing. I'm very, very happy about it. Good. Tell us when and we'll be on, I would hope. Unless, obviously, I'm doing the um, my FM21 save. But I'll still probably not be in it. I, Corey, mate, you're not going to get made a mod anytime soon, mate, I'm afraid to say. Sorry. <laughs> I'm not really looking for any more moderators. And plus, like I said, if there's going to be... There are a few people I'd, I'd already have in mind for it. You're too young, mate. With the greatest respect. Congrats on well that. Thank you very much. Um, I'm very, very happy to hear it. Thank you, Rachel. Come on. I want to beat Cheltenham now. Because this is, like I said, it's like a local derby. So this needs to be one. Oh, I'm just relax. I can chill now. I can just relax. I've done the job. I've come here. I've got us promoted. That's what I mean. I'm not mean at all. Give me that, Rachel. Don't you start coming in here. <laughs> no, because I know what you told me you were earlier. I'm not having it. Go on, Cal. Off you go, mate. Roast him. Well informed. There you go. Ask some of that Cheltenham. Yeah. Literally was carnage on the streets of Cheltenham and Gloucester. No. <laughs> Anyone who asks to be a mod is not worthy of being a mod. <laughs> that's my that's my mantra. Um it's alright, Seabird. Mate, you missed us getting promoted, Seabird. We've achieved promotion, mate. It's been done. Oh, what the hell? You missed the promotion, Seabird. That's the best bit, mate. You've, you've literally missed the whole point of the entire stream. Sometimes I question your commitment. We've got five points to go. Mm. Yeah. Well, I know we can't win the title. Why am I even bothering looking at it? I know we can't win the title. Why am I bothering to look? Silly boy. Oh, this makes me feel. <laughs> oh, I've I've seen around Adam. It doesn't matter anyway. Like I said, I'm not looking for mods right now, so don't worry about it. There's no infamous bottling. Uh, Seabird, you and these calls, mate. A real one this time, you you sod. You get. You liar, liar. Oh hello. Oh, dear me. I've, I don't know why I've done that. I've just got a pang of Chris there. Oh, God. Now you've, you've scared me now, Adam, because that could be true. <laughs> that might actually happen. Why did you tell me that? I didn't even think about that. But, yeah, the bottling might happen later on in there. I bloody well hope not, or I'll be very upset. Good tackle. Lloyd, no. Come on, someone get on him. Don't don't let them equalise. Yes. No hashtag bottle job for Mike. You know what, Rachel? Excuse me. Just just calm it down a minute here. Thank you. I don't like being infamous for that, but I kind of can't lie and say, yeah, okay, I'm a professional bottle jobber. I mean, that's exactly what everyone wants to be. What's that, Rachel? What's the important question? Oh, she comes on and literally just starts causing havoc. Is Mike, is Mike still a Schmoesby? You are an absolute... I can't say it on here. PC gamer. Good man. That's the way forward. I love a bit of PC gaming. Some Phasmophobia. Oh, I need to play Phasmophobia again. I played it with my mates the other night and I just loved it so good. Uh, can I add you on Steam, Mike? Uh, yeah. I'm not on it that often, mate. But yeah, I don't really see why not. It shouldn't be too much of an issue. I'll... Uh, We'll figure something out, mate. You can always just drop whatever your code is in the Discord or whatever. You might be able to find me anyway. I don't really know how you find people on Steam anymore. 
I'm barely ever on it, mate, to be honest, because half the time I'm recording. So, hi, Rachel. You're so funny. So unnecessarily funny. Oh, my God. Good clearance there. Hello, Cleo. Cleo, we got promoted, but we can't win the title. So we beat Wimbledon, and then we drew. So it's not... Well, Rachel, I mean, like we could always play some Faz later if you fancied. I'm up for some Faz. I love a bit of Faz. I love a bit of Phasmophobia. It goes a long way. <laughs> I was going to say, what did you have for dinner, though, Cleo? That's the most important thing. Because that's actually more what I'm interested in. Thank you very much, yeah. Yeah, I don't know why it comes up for review. I have no idea why. It shouldn't do. It's annoying. Yeah, yeah, go on. Do you want to get in touch with him, Rachel, and find out? If you could find out if the focus is up for it, that'd be grand. Beauty. Love it. <sighs> Chicken and potato. Decent. I like it. Uh, so, that is... We could finish second, then. If Plymouth dropped points on the final day, we could finish second, which would be pretty amazing, to be fair. Considering where we started, when I came in, we were 18th, I think. And then to get all the way up to this is amazing. Honey roast gammon dinner. Oh, mate, that's beautiful. In 20 minutes, the stream will be over by then as well, because we've only got one game left to go. It's gone very, very well. Um, so we'll be done soon as well. Which I'm looking forward to. Oh, got Cambridge up. I mean, this here. Can you imagine if we keep up this sort of like run of form in League in League One? What's happened? I have no idea what I've done, but somehow I just seem to be on fire. Hello, Chris. Chris, mate. Tonight promotion in the Manchester Rover save. You need to be there, fella. You need to be there. It's okay to be late, mate, but. Twitch tonight, Chris. We're gonna be on, we're gonna be on it, absolutely on it. I need you to turn in a good performance. It's not come up now, Cleo. You're okay now. It's just sometimes I don't know why it only occasionally comes up. Uh, when am I gonna be on Twitch? Uh, that's a good question. Probably around between seven and eight tonight. Uh, so just keep an eye out on my Twitter, keep an eye out on my Discord and stuff, and I'll let you know when I'm gonna be on. But it'll probably be between seven and eight tonight. I'm hoping that um, I'm going to get myself in like a Domino's pizza or something, just to, to or any other pizza firms are available, um, so I can get that down me as some sort of sustenance, and then we're going to have a big old stream, a big old binge between seven and eight, or well, starting at seven and eight, and um, yeah, it's a big, big game. Well, not get well. The first game actually is massive. The first game is against New Mills, and they're currently second to us by like one minute by one point so it's going to be very very tense yeah you'd know your player was doing rachel if you turned up but you don't so you know just saying disloyal that's what you are you liar i think it might be because i spam arsenal fan tv too much chat <laughs> Maybe. Maybe they caught up to it. Love it. Anyway, here we go. Final game of the season then. All we can do is finish second. Either way, I'd say it's been a pretty successful season. What started off with us in Italy being absolutely terrible has ended up with me being in League 2 and being absolutely unreal, which is amazing. If we can just beat Cambridge, hope that Plymouth drops some points, I'll get, we'll get second and I'll be happy with that. That would make me very, very happy. At least let's hope so, anyway. You're checking out tonight. Thank you, Rachel. I mean, that, that means the world to me. Thank you. My Twitch. It's uh, just Micromunch under... It's just Micromunch14, mate. Or twitch.tv slash Micromunch14. Adam, if you could drop the link in the description in the chat, mate, that'd be amazing, please. Uh, 
it'd be great if we could get loads of people in today um in for tonight because it's going to be a massive stream. and we keep gaining followers and subs at the moment as well which is amazing and it's just really really good that's why i'm enjoying so much of the twitch at the moment teapot yeah this twitch thing is in the local pubs <laughs> teapot because of the age of some of the people in the chat mate probably best to keep it to yourself at the moment ah <laughs> oh, plymouth for winning that's annoying thanks adam cheers mate That's annoying. That's really annoying. So yeah, t- try and keep it as appropriate as you can, Teapot. Twitch stream later is fine. Uh, between 7 and 8, Rachel, so just keep an eye out for that. And let me know when you're playing Final Fantasy, and then I'll tune in and watch that. As I would appreciate that everyone should go, go check out twitch.tv slash rachella1, because Rachel's stuff is pretty damn good. So I'd advise that you go and check it out. She's a She's a good watch. As is the gameplay. Oh! See what I did there. It's true though. She is actually. She's quite good. So watch. Cadden's knackered. Might have to bring on Solomon. It's been a riveting last game of the season. I have to say. Absolutely riveting stuff. So you can swear on. Um, I wouldn't. I I don't particularly like people swearing that much. At least not the word you used earlier. But you know, I'm I'm open to it, as it were. But don't. As long as you don't say it every single sentence, that's fine. When it's when it's needed, then fine. But for the most part, we're all quite pretty well mannered in the chat. We don't swear a lot, which is the way that I quite like it. To be fair. See you later, Rachel. Speak to you later. All the best. Bye. Go on. Go on, Coville. Hit it. Not there. Not into him. That's like it, mate. It's it just in 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 moderation is the best way to put it. Aaron Collins has scored. Beautiful. <laughs> I think that's fair enough, mate. When people rage, I can understand where it comes from. I, I try not to swear that much. When I'm on my own, I'm playing on my own. I'm horrendous at swearing. Like I'm absolutely atrocious at it. But I think maybe it's because I kind of have to maintain a sort of semi sort of like professional image on this. I'm a little less, I'm a little less ragey than I normally would be, which some people are going to laugh at. I know you are, Seabird, but um, I'm not actually that bad on here. But I can be quite bad. Yeah, basically. <laughs> Uh, I always believe in your ability to lead this team to promotion. Well, thank you. You did actually say, Jammy, to be fair. You did say that I would do it. And I, I didn't believe it. But actually, we've we've done it with, with time to spare. I thought it was going to come right down to the wire. I thought we might be able to sneak into playoffs. But, I mean, this, this run of form has been un, unprecedented, it's safe to say. We've literally been unbelievably good. For like the last four months. We haven't lost in five months. That's how good this team is. We haven't lost in five months. If I'd been here at the start of the season. We would have walked this league. You swear when I lose. <laughs> oh Coville no mate. That's fair enough mate. Someone's got to do it for me. <laughs> thank you very much everyone that's left a like by the way. We're up to 13 likes which is amazing. So thank you. And it's been a nice way to end this week's worth of streaming on this this has been good, I've enjoyed myself and hopefully if we beat Cambridge it's a shame that Plymouth aren't going to drop points otherwise we would be able to finish second I think what I can take heart from is if I'd been here at the start of this season then we would have won uh, we probably would have won the league quietly, quite comfortably I think, Plymouth won 4-0 by the way so I was never going to get second but I'll take third, from where we were I'll take third That's that's a pretty impressive haul and then we've also got to... Uh... Oh, God, mate, that happens to me all the time on this game. Solomon's not... He keeps scoring, but he's always blooming offside. Silly boy. Right, okay, let's just finish this off then. And I'm... <sighs> I thought it was going to be more dramatic, I won't lie. I thought we might be in the middle of like a title race or something like that. But it's been a little less dramatic than I thought it would be. But not that that's a bad thing. I'm just pretty pleased. I didn't really think we were going to be able to get into the automatic promotion spots, but we have somehow, incredibly. And, uh, yeah, I mean, magic. Beautiful. Well, lads, it was a good win. What a way to finish your season. 
a one nil win away at Cambridge, but more importantly is the fact that we barely lost. When was the last time we lost then? Scumfort. Literally, we have not lost in five months worth of football. That is insane. It's insane. There you go. I've got £5,000 for coming third in League 2. Um, unbelievable. <laughs> no worries, Corey. Um, I will end it there, guys. But next time you come back, we're going to be having, obviously, our um, our summer transfer window, which we're going to be spending a fair bit of time on. So keep an eye out for that stream this week. It probably won't be tomorrow. Maybe it will more likely be Tuesday. But keep an eye out. Thank you so much for watching this episode. Thank you for watching the stream. Thank you for the likes. Thank you for everyone in there. Thank you, Corey. Thank you, Rachel. Thank you, Jamie. Thank you, Sebi. Thank you, Teapot. Thank you, Adam. Thank you, everyone else. Anyone else that I've forgotten. But just thank you, everyone. It's been great fun. I've really enjoyed it. I shall see you all very very soon hopefully see you on twitch later if you've not joined in on the twitch save make sure that you do it's gone really really well and i'm absolutely loving it take care everyone speak to you later all the best stay cool bye